Okay, the dreaded walk error for the Affinity Fridge Dairy. Okay, so we got a new control board. Hopefully that will solve the problem. There's not much instructions. Be sure to unhinge the clips that hold the control housing together before removing the control board. Once the control board housing is removed, lift the control knob component before attempting to remove. Whatever that means. Be sure to depress these two locking tabs. Which locking tabs? <sighs> Let's see. Uh, move these three tabs of the off the control module for proper installation before reinstalling. Three tabs off the control module. Oh, I don't see that. Three tabs. Control module. Oh, I'm not seeing that, man. What's up with that, guys? Oh. It looks different. Place the control board under these tabs to ensure proper installation. Make sure the control stem and the access knob key. Yeah, it's new now. Okay, so here's what we got. Okay, it comes, comes apart fairly easily. I, I did notice that this board is, does not look burnt. It does have some signs of wear. It does not look burnt. This is the new one. Looks a little different. Let's see. So what they're concerned about is this little knob thing. It's got to be set in the right place on that part there. Okay, so I can tell you that these little tabs that hold this board in place, they're not very good. So if you tend to want to bend them a little bit more than you have to, they will tweak out of place. And so in this case, we're going to use hot, hot glue to uh, make sure these little clamps are going to hold down. And then hopefully that will solve the problem. We don't know. We'll soon find out. Okay, so we did check the thermostats on this. And there's actually not too much else that could go wrong with it. Look at that control board. Thermostats were all good. And so we got the new control board in. Everything's hooked up okay. And let's give it a quick check here. Oh, three beeps, no lights. We got the door lock. Oh, okay, wow. That's how that works, right? No. Oh, not a. So, yeah. Unfortunately, not as easy as it seems. Here's the start relay. I would imagine we could probably just put a button across that or somewhere in the circuit to solve that problem. Okay, nightmare continues. So much for the affinity. Frigidaire rhymes with nightmare. <laughs>